Hi, Clark Sharks. I'm so excited to have you come to the building and be at school with us and learn and play on the playground. And one thing that we know is that we must wear a mask. So Mrs. Ollie's going to read you a story about little Spot wearing a mask. Little Spot wears a mask. Hi, my name is Spot. I brought these new masks for you to wear. There is this virus going around that is making some people very sick. So we need to wear masks to help prevent this virus from spreading. Since the virus can spread without people feeling sick, wearing masks protects everyone. How do masks help? When you sneeze or cough, droplets fly out of your nose or your mouth. These droplets have germs in them and can travel six feet the length of your bed. Not all germs are bad, but if some germs contain a virus, they can make people very sick. Some viruses are contagious, which means they can spread quickly to other people and make them sick. That is why it is so important to cough or sneeze in your elbow and wash your hands. But sometimes that isn't enough. So we need to add a layer of extra protection. Oops, that's where masks can help. A mask can block some of the germs from traveling. For a mask to work best, it needs to cover your nose and your mouth because that's where the germs come in and out. There is also a right way to put on a mask. Let me show you. The first thing we need to remember is to wash our hands before putting on a mask and after taking it off. Okay, now let's put it on. The next step when putting a mask on is to only touch the loops. Try to avoid touching the fabric part of the mask because that's where most of the germs are found. Step one, hold the mask by the loops. Step two, bring the mask to your face, place the loops over your ears. Woohoo, you did it. When taking off a mask, only grab the loops. Remember, the fabric is where the mask can have germs. Step one, carefully remove the loop over one ear. Step two, while holding the other side, remove the loop over the other ear. You did it. Now let's make sure to put it in a safe spot. A safe place to store masks are little plastic bags. Bring a few extra clean masks to school in case they get dirty. Also, make sure to wash your reusable masks at home after you wear them. A common way a mask can get dirty is when you sneeze. This is a perfect time to change your mask. Even though you are wearing a mask, you should still cover your mouth with your elbow for extra protection. At lunch or during snack time, you'll need to remove your mask to eat. Once you remove your mask, be sure to put it in a safe place and wash your hands. Then after you eat, wash your hands and put your mask back on. Now that you know how to wear a mask, it's time to have a little fun. I know masks can feel a little funny at first, so I have some tips to make them more comfortable. You can pick out your own fabric. There are so many styles and colors. You can even use some clothing you already have, like a bandana. You could have an adult help you find breathable fabric to make into a mask. Get creative. You can decorate a clean mask with crayons or markers. Use your imagination. Using masks when you play is a great way to get used to wearing masks and seeing masks. You could be a superhero or a veterinarian. Take funny photos with your masks on. Ask your family and friends to take pictures of themselves in masks too. The more you see and wear masks, the more comfortable they will become. Okay, it's time to practice. Put on your mask and take it off. You're doing amazing. Now try to put it on and take your, off your mask five times in a row. I'm so proud of you. I hope these tips can help wearing a mask, making wearing a mask easier. I can't wait to see what mask you're going to wear at school. Clark Sharks, we are all gonna be wearing masks when we're at school together. And you will have a chance to take off your mask if you bring snack during recess time. We have bags for you to put your masks in to keep them safe. And if you need to bring an extra mask, you can keep that in your backpack. I can't wait to see you. And I can't wait to see what kind of mask you're wearing.